for Cali this weekend. What's going on, Cali? What's good? This weekend, I'm walking a ball in LA. It's the April Fool's Day ball. Now, I'm going to say this here, and this is my last time seeing it. I won my category last year. I won OTA Runway. I won the thousand dollars that was on the line, honey. And I'm going to defend my title. <laughs> for the ball last year. Yes, honey. Grand prize drags runway, but I also won the OTA runway. But enough about that. That is just the importance of, you know, the background and story of me walking this ball and making sure I'm going to walk this category again. Yeah. But, out the box. I'm performing in San Diego on Sunday. But, the reason I just said, ouch is because my nail broke off so bad. So I couldn't even fake the funk and like just hold off or get like a fill in. I had to get my nails done. And it is a nail tech, a black nail tech. I believe she's black. We'll find out. She's in Brooklyn and we've been wanting to collab. So I told her, I'm like, girl, I had just got my nails done when I hit her up. So, when I need a fill-in or whatever is going on. So this was just the perfect opportunity. It's like I'm walking the ball. I have a performance. I'm going to be taking a lot of like high quality pictures this weekend. So I can definitely like take some cute ones on my nails and whatnot. And post her up and do like some fun stuff. I'm also like vlogging this experience. Because you know trying a new nail tech is like really scary. So I'm going to bring y'all along with me. Don't mind the clothes right there. Those are Hoshi's and Mermaid's clothes. I need to give those to them. And then that little junk over there in the corner is so hard to keep that corner clean. It's like, I just be throwing stuff over there when I'm doing my makeup. But all right, y'all, let's hit it because we got a long day ahead of us. Because I got to go to the city, then to Brooklyn, then back home. And hopefully I can do it in some sort of time that allows me to still... I need to wash this other wig. I could brush it out, though, and just recrimp it. But then I'm going to start fucking the hair up. But all right. Let's get it, y'all. We gotta go. Hey, y'all. So, I am about to head out and get in my Uber. Because I gotta take the Uber to the Staples. But I don't want y'all coming for me. I did pack some lobster pasta that I took home from work yesterday to eat on my train ride to the city. So, y'all don't have to be like, what did you eat? Um, I'm definitely feeding myself. Oh, my God. This pimple. I just popped it. I needed to go away by this weekend. Hey y'all, so I'm in like the trimming store. I'm just getting some last minute things for the gig on Sunday. Yeah, we just got 5,000 stones. I already have some trimming at home that's kind of the same color. And then I just needed another E6000 glue. These glues there. I literally love this store. It's the best. Come here and get all of the goodies for ballroom, for performances, and sometimes just a cute outfit. But now it's time to head to Brooklyn to get my nails dead. And then while I'm in Brooklyn, I just need to get, um, I should go this way. I just need to get a pack of CDs because I need to crush some CDs to put on a jacket and some stuff. And we're going to get real cheap creative and end up with some glitz and glam. How about that? Chauncey. I used to live a street over when I first moved to New York. Yes. Oh, shoot. I got off the train. I said, It's your own name. Look at that. My own name. I'm like, Am I about to go to Dunkin' Donuts? No, let me hear this. Let me just hurry up. It's a little rough sketch of what we got going on. And then this the finished product. We're going to see it all. I'm together. excited. I'm excited too. <laughs> They 
are fire. Y'all have to get in. Let me get close up to. This is really, this is definitely, you know, everybody has a favorite nail. This is definitely my favorite nail. It's the snake skin, the jewels, and the nude. Y'all know I love nude and white. Make sure you all are following me on Instagram. Make sure you follow Three Roses Nails on Instagram. Book your appointments with my girl. Support my women of color out here doing now. But no, thank you. We are about. This we are vibe. about to turn it. I love this. It was so much fun. I'm trying to tell. The vibe. The vibe. This was the best <laughs> nail experience ever. When I tell you, I felt good. I felt relaxed. I felt like Yay. yes, I can chill. I don't yes. have to be on like pins and needles. Like what's going on around me? I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. And that's the vibe you need to have when you get your nails done. Absolutely. <laughs> you don't need to be stressed out getting your nails done. Mm -mm. It's self-care. But the, I'm trying to tell you, the best part <laughs> is knowing what they're going to look like yes. before they're done. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, and you know what? Like, a good black woman created this book. Uh, come on now. Come on. Amazing. Come on. Amazing. I'm trying to tell you all. Stunning is a habit. Get like me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, That's good y'all. I'm at Wingstop. I just got back to Long Island from Brooklyn. I love my nails. I love them. They're so cute. But right now, I'm at Wingstop. I'm literally here. I just don't want to be putting people on camera. I feel like that's kind of rude, but um, yeah, I just got me a 10 piece, some loaded fries, and I should have got some snacks, but. Yeah, I should have got some snacks, but I did that. I'm waiting for my food to get ready, and then I'm waiting for my sister to come get me. She had to go to the bank at the same time that I got off the train. So, it all worked out. I will talk to y'all when I get home. It's been a long day, y'all, but I, I'm almost done with everything that I needed to get done. This boy keep being so weird staring. I don't like when people stare. Like, all that staring is going to get you embarrassed. Because when I pull this mask down and be like, sir, what are you looking at? What do you want? What do you want from me? Because I'm a boy. You're going to be over it. You're going to be feeling all types of just emasculated because your ass was intrigued and staring. Don't play yourself with your socks out. He look crazy. He look crazy with this little grouchy, grumpy ass attitude. He look like a Muppet with an attitude like this. You can't be having all these struggles at once. You can't do that. But all right, y'all. All right, y'all. So I'm home, clearly. And I'm, like, throwing stuff onto the bed that I'm thinking about wanting to pack. But I just need to, like, take a second. Because I've just decided that I'm going to just make tonight, like, an all-nighter. I'm going to put on. Good morning. I'm at the airport, y'all. It is 5.54. I mean, 5.48. We board in like 10 minutes basically, and then we depart at 6.30. My skin is doing good. Everything is chilling. I feel like I look cute at the airport today, y'all. I feel like when I get to LA, I'm gonna take my coat off, and it's gonna look way cuter. It's gonna look like very like, get me. But yeah. Right now, I just look cold as fuck. And I got decaf coffee for like the first time in my life because I'm like, I really want coffee and I think that this might just be like the cure to my addiction. So y'all tell me like, is decaf coffee good for you? Like not good for you. It has sugar, like I still drink mine with sugar. I got a blueberry muffin from um, from the gas station. So Mermaid brought me to the airport this morning because I was like, I do not want to pay for an expensive Uber. I'm gonna see if my Girl, that's not my flight, hush. Decaf coffee's not bad, though. It is missing that little tang of caffeine. So something to have to get used to, but I mean, I think I can do it. I think I can. LA Mother T, what's good? Ah, we on our way to the open this one, sister. No. <laughs> Yo, we just got ready. I'm in the rollers. Okay. Um, we out of here. We're doing it. Let me take a little sip of this. This is the Asian juice. Okay, I'll be going fast out. though. Like, bag. full. Yeah. Full, shut done, done. Hour and a half. Let's hit it. Right. I would drink my sweet tea, but I'm going to be tucking and not tucking all night. No, ma'am. All right, y'all. So I'm at the bar. I don't know if y'all can hear me. 
but if you can hear me, I'm at the ball. We made it. Things going on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, there's the virgins battling for like, I'm getting hot. I'm getting hot. Alright, so I'm gonna talk to y'all when something else happens. I'm bored. It's a push. It's the aesthetic. <laughs> so yeah, we're here on Yale Ave. You know, with the girls get down and dirty. Okay. It's dark, but I'm a daytime girl. <laughs> we're here. I am weak. We're gonna eat brunch. It's gonna be super fast. It's gonna be super cool. Let me show you my look for today. Inspired by who? It's inspired. Well, the hair is inspired by everything. The hat is inspired by me, of course. <laughs> I was waiting for that. The, the rest of the outfit is inspired by LA because I feel like you guys are always ready for a hike. Okay. <laughs> Mind you. And actually, if you go up two blocks, okay. the beach is right there. Okay. Like, okay, I'm on my way. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm over here with Cotton the Box. <laughs> Not your regular jack in the box. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Y'all, they pulled up on me. Pull up. So I have to uh, bitch, I have <laughs> She is cutting a box, bitch. Cutting a box. You're going to ask the girls about me. That's okay, baby. This is what I want to see. This is what I want to see. This is what I want to see. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. I said, I'll tell him about 
I gotta charge the phone, but y'all, we are getting what's good, what's good? day two, but still in the same day. Okay. Um, we are <laughs> day two, but still in the okay. Same day. So, Fee got this heat presser that's like super duper duper hot, <laughs> it's super hot, first of all, but it's like a heat presser and like the stones that come like on the strips and stuff, we can pretty much just put them on. And clamp it on down and get a star spangled booty. Oh, that's what it means. Zulu do our ditty. Zulu do our ditty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so cute. Y'all know I love LA. Y'all know my y'all know my goals and things. Cannot wait to be out here more full time. But yes, LA has been cute to me yet again. Last night at the ball, I was second to last battle. I probably said this yesterday, but I was second to last battle. But the person I was walking against, they was pumping. We was both pumping. It was a good battle. I didn't feel like they ate me up. I just felt like they it's going to go them. either way to whoever they want to see battle the next person. Because that would be another thing in ballroom, too. The judges know who's next. And sometimes they be like, I've been wanting to see those two go at it. So, Milan, you was showing it. It was doing good, but we well, need to want, see them. I want to see them. I need to see that battle because there's no shade. It was it was a good three or four of us there that was, we came to pump. And we came for the coin. <laughs> you can tell there was a few people that came for the coin last night. For sure. Yeah, for runway, it was, the girls was pumping, but it was a few girls that was given. I came tonight. I've been waiting. It's late as fuck. Let's get with it. All right, y'all, so we're about to clamp it on down. Do the do I Do the do I And they went from just being a cute little club outfit <laughs> to being a full-on effect. Oh, my goodness, this is so crazy. Yes, and then we go, boom. Do I did it. Do I did it, and we see what it's <laughs> Hey y'all, so we have hair. Y'all, so my mother C just got this two units to together. Okay. Baby, we're ready to throw her on. Calypso should be here any minute now to pick me up. Then we're gonna ride out to San Diego. I need the girls in the picture. I can't wait to get into my hotel room and just explode this bag because I feel like I stuffed everything in here to get to LA and then I just have been removing and shifting all this crap around so I would like to get it all out so I can see everything because <clears throat> most of the junk in there is for tonight because the effect was pretty much already put together. This was the moment that's like got a, got a lot of little bits and pieces so let's get it girl. All right, y'all, so I'm here, 11, I'm at the Sheraton Hotel, and we are going to my room, which is 11.15, oh my God, I'm trying to steer this, record, <laughs> and do too much, and pay the fact that I have terrible bangs that I cut myself in this wig, so I need somebody to help me fix it, but I found my room. <sighs> okay. I'm in the hotel. I'm in the Sheraton. I'm in the San Diego. I got my wig over here. Feet and got my scoop did a do all the way together. She's kind. But yeah, smells like spritz. Black girl's fantasy. These bangs are so bad that I cut in this wig, but I'm gonna get somebody to help me like make it frame my face better. I should have asked Feet, can you frame this real quick? Cause she would have just cut it, but. She did so much for me this week, and I was not about to ask her to help me fix my bang that I fucked up. Like, that's not what we're doing. But I just love this wig I made, y'all. She's so long. I can't remember. I think this hair is 34 inches. But I need to hurry up and get ready. I have an hour. So I'm pulling out all of my stuff. What I'm actually performing in is here. We blinged out. Oh, that's why it didn't look great. I'm like, what's going on? We blinged out. 
the coochie cutters, which are literally coochie cutters. So cute, fun, right? And then, what kind of YouTuber did I just turn into? So cute and fun, right? Girl, please. And then, my titty jingles. Ah, it's gonna be so cute together. I'm gonna look like a little hot girl, like I always like to look like. And then this is like, I'm gonna play with this rope and stuff for my body. So that's over there. Right now I'm just looking for my white fishnet so I can get in the shower, take my boots out. Cause it's really just boot, it's just that. Boots, my fishnets, and yeah. Here go the fishnets. I shouldn't be snatching them like this, but we need them. My fishnetas. All right, and then now I'm just gonna pretty much just, I'm not sleeping on this bed, so I'm putting anything on this bed. That's my primer I'm using for my face. <laughs> Stores everything. Yes, so cute. Shoes galore. Those are cute as fuck. But why? Why they don't get like sizes for us? And that's why I be over. I see the shoe. No, Cape Robin though. Cape Robin be having sizes for us. Cape Robin. I don't know about lemonade, but Cape Robin they always have sizes that go up. These jeans. Oh yeah, I will fuck those. I have a great pair, actually. I literally have a great pair. Thanks, how much? Just out of the Nine. Will you on? Mm-hmm. I need a nine and a half for a ten. Right. Yeah. Why are they playing? Oh. Uh, uh, what is you doing, y'all? <laughs> Very much needed. I just wish the I, I wish the jeans was tighter to my. I love the third eye moment. I'm living. I'm, I live for a bootcut. I live for a bootcut. You just have to find a, the right shoe with a bootcut. That's just gonna be twenty dollars. It really better be. What's Absolutely that? not. What's Three, that? Five. Okay. Okay. Alright, this is cute. Alright, what's cute? It was fine. But the price is long. Bitch, we out here. What's going on? Hi. Hey. What's good? I'm out here with my sisters. It's the last stroll. Hey. You know me. Bitch, look at these I learned that. A uh, rich white man that had access to a chat when motherfucking cut them bitches down from Florida, uh -huh. brought them over uh -huh. to California, uh -huh. started breeding them in a line. That's yeah. that little cute line, that street that you see all the famous people on. And then, you know, the uh, the population just grew, honey. The yeah. eggs was flying in the air and yeah. everything, and now they're everywhere in California. Get Girl. into the trees. Okay, get into the trees. 
<laughs> but we always fucking some shit up. <laughs> I'm no wrong with we'll that. We'll work out for Palm Sunday. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Bring my hut out right in this whole section. Y'all, they got every motherfucking thing in this goddamn gas station, bitch. They got goddamn bobby pins, hairbrushes, hair ties, razors, motherfucking tie to go pins, deodorant, girl. You get a full drag over here. But I just got some fruits, some Mykonites, and an icy. I so good. It feels so good outside. It's gotta be at least like 70 something. I'm just over there trying to get the tea. Like literally trying to get the coffee and tea over there. And she cannot figure out. What's good, baby? Oh, girl. I need the phone to pay for it. Charge. No, she, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think she charged, but she's on. But I'm out. <laughs> Wait, what kind of camera is it? This is Sony A5100. It's like a vlog camera. I'll send you the link. It's, okay. it's like three years old now, girl. Yes, it's to get it. But yeah, I'm about to leave y'all. Yeah, so we came back from our walk. We got ICs and fucking fruit and shit and all of that. But we're about to go. Well, I'm about to go, but we're all leaving. You and all leave today, so. Yeah, but. I love you. I love you more, sister. Oh my god. See you, gorgeous. All right, Mwah. you leave tomorrow, right? I leave tomorrow. tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow. Okay, all righty. Amir, let's get it. Adriana, get the fuck up. Wake the fuck up, act, act the fuck up. Bye, girl. All right, nephew, let's go. Mm. My sister is waiting. Damn, my ass is hot. I know yours is too, the sea woman's is on. Is it? Oh, she recording a video. Of course. <laughs>